a robot. Just might be your next delivery man in use. Yeah, a company just launched the program within the last month, teaming up with restaurants to potentially deliver your next meal. Our Steve Campion takes us inside how these bots work, and he's live in the newsroom. Steve, we're fascinated by this. Adam, me too. I recently was going down my street when I looked over to the left and I saw this giant bot. Then I saw a woman reach in the bot and grab her meal. Then the bot took off. Little did I realize that the future is here. On the sidewalk of the Southwest Freeway feeder, this remote piloted robot whizzed by this afternoon, headed to the mighty 13. Our television station's assignments manager, Jason Jobes, quick to step outside and grab the meal tucked inside the bot. It was inside Trendy Dumpling where this bot's journey began. Ling Wing, who goes by JoJo, is famous for her handmade creations. I was so lucky and we, we they chose us. So when I got the email from the robot company, I was like, wow, I'm so lucky. Earlier this year, the startup named Coco reached out to JoJo about bringing the delivery bots to her restaurant. She quickly fell in love. So cute, I was, I, I was recording them. So the bot itself is run electronically, uh, human piloted, um, as you can see, um, it's fully LED, so nighttime. It's got front and rear lights, plus side lights and a flag light, so people can see it coming. Joshua Hawkins with Coco says there's five cameras on board the devices. A pilot uses GPS to navigate it to the customer. Since their March 21st launch, things are looking good. It's just one of the things that, um, because the flag, some people might not be paying attention for whatever reason, and accidents do happen. It's, it's you know, it's, you can't really predict that. Um, but, I mean, for the most part, we, as of Houston right now, we haven't had any hit by cars yet. So that's, that's good, you know, keeping our fingers crossed. And that's where I say, wow, keeping our fingers crossed. I literally saw a bot crossing Westheimer yesterday. Coco says that they've teamed up with four Houston restaurants so far. They're looking to expand. And right now you can place an order via DoorDash to any of those restaurants. And that's how you might get the bot to come to your front door.